to better serve the growing communities of Syracuse, Clearfield, Clinton, West Point, and Sunset in Northwest Davis County, the Lindquist family is pleased to announce its newest mortuary in Syracuse, now under construction. For five generations, the Lindquist family has been helping other families in their time of need. The Lindquist story began in 1863 when Niels Lindquist, a recent convert to the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints, emigrated from Sweden. An accomplished cabinet and furniture maker, Niels was called by Brigham Young to help settle Cache Valley, where he made furniture and soon caskets. In 1867, he established N.A. Lindquist Furniture and Undertaking Goods. In 1885, Neil's oldest son moved to Ogden to establish a mortuary, and now, 153 years later, Lindquist Mortuary Cemeteries is one of Utah's oldest businesses with eight mortuaries, three cemeteries, and two crematories. Lindquist takes great care in serving veterans and honoring their sacrifices in behalf of our country. Complementing Lindquist's other Davis County mortuaries in Bountiful, Kaysville, and Layton, the new 13,000 square foot Syracuse Mortuary will closely resemble Lindquist's Roy Mortuary with its distinctive colonial style from a convenient location. On 2000 West near Syracuse High School and Intermountain Healthcare Syracuse Clinic, with a long legacy and a strong commitment to local communities, Lindquist has actively supported the Davis Arts Council, the Davis Education Foundation, and Davis Chamber of Commerce and Weber State University, including 40 years of the Pops concert and fireworks show at the Ogden campus each July. The Lindquist family and many associates believe strongly in serving and giving back. We look forward to having you join us for an open house and dedication of Lindquist's new Syracuse Mortuary in December 2020. When your family is in need, call on Lindquist for the personalized care Utah families have come to trust for five generations.